work. Um, it is 4.58. It is kind of quiet here. I know that I have a lot of things that I will have to do today. Mondays are the busy day. Um, since she leaves, that it was like the HR person moved to another store. I'm in charge to do some of the schedules. Well, actually, all the schedules for the store. I will be honest, it's sometimes overwhelming, but I try to do the best that I can. They open for me the um, office that was Shelly's office, and I try to do it there. It's a little more calm. It has a nice desk. The chair is not so comfortable, but the desk can be the kind that you stand up and I have fun <laughs> playing with that desk. And uh, I love to be able to do all that kind of things standing. Um, other things that I supposed to be doing today is I love to restock the coolers with all the sodas because more in the weekend is like you get so many customers and those coolers get really empty and I try to just restock all of those I make sure every day that have all the schedules and everything working also for the front end that is all the cashiers and the cleaning of garden <laughs> garden takes a little time to get clean because it's the area that right now everybody visit the most and uh, cashiers it's not that they are messy well you have some of them that they love to be messy but they don't have the time to clean between customers sometimes it's so much so many customers oh, who blame them if you see the garden center actually oh my gosh is so nice right now and the trucks are arriving like almost every other day with new flowers and veggies and everything i think all my paycheck is going there yeah that's my work day right now i know that during the week i will have to take care of also all the signs for the store another thing that i do is set everything ready for the Wednesday night, that is when we have pre-made signs. And so far, oh, this week I will have vacation time. I will be off Friday, Saturday, Sunday, and Monday from the next week. Oh, I hope it's sunny. I have so many garden projects. gosh this is a, such a good idea sadly my harvest is not a lot so but anyway I will put a picture and you can just use that if you want to donate some of your harvest
here. We're going to put my box together for lunch. I'm using this lunch box I got from Amazon. Let me see if I can show you better. Okay. Here I have a little bag that it has some um, organic sugar, gum, tea, uh, if I have a sore throat, and some not, uh, for organic spoon. Of course it's clean. My um, mug, this is from Las Vegas, so I think I got like how many years ago? Oof, 10 at least. Usually my breakfast goes with a protein bar, coffee. I don't like my coffee without creamer. And I use a plant-based creamer that I finally found that is really, really nice. Lunch. One of my meals preparations. It's a wild rice with chicken and uh, butternut squash. This used to be containers that I have from when I was doing workout back fitness. My breakfast is like my first break, then I have my lunch. And I have here for my lunch also some uh, onion pickles that I homemade. I love that combination. And for my last break, I have a combination of uh, coconut yogurt. It has only like this quantity here, it's like, uh, less than 50 calories the fruit that I made for my week with a little of honey I have pre-made meals for all the week and I can can I show you how we said I do this just to control my macros and my calories I woke up a fine morning planning to do my gardening and stuff and now it's almost seven. <laughs> I have not done anything. I just put new battery for the camera and I will charge, have my dogs ready, get my stuff ready and go to do my first projects in the garden. Okay, first I have to put my trellis. This is a new trellis that I got. The other one I'm using for the dogs. Did I bring my scissors? Yes. I have these new flowers and I have some other flowers that are waiting. So and the neighbor is there. So I'm talking really low, really low. And time to move with these. Yeah, I don't need any of the other stuff. Let's get this car going.
Okay, the idea is that that clementis will go all the way in the wall. Then it comes this beautiful salvin that is purple and is taller, can go to almost three feet. Then comes that one. That I have the white one, and I have this that is not salvia, but it will give it color. Okay, trying to tie up this. I was able to tie that one. That one, that one. Too much. I need to tie up a little of these. Oh, so hard to know which one. All these look the same. I'm sure this is all wheat. I cannot recognize anything. This looks a little different. Can that be different? I don't know. But I have to put these vines up. Let's see. Okay, I give up. I need to get everything there. So it's a little more tight. Now I have to work on this area. I have to build my bed here. So I have to make this flat, put bricks, and fix it. The sun is trying to come, so I need to hurry up before it gets really sunny. I left this behind. I was able to clean. Then I will have to compact and put in one level, put some bricks. I have all the grass and everything that I throw away. I have my companion here and we're going outside. Let's get this going. I'm taking care of all these, trying to give it a little shape. I think at this one I have to do a little shorter. And then I will go to do, continue doing all of those. So it looks more neat. And I have to sweep all these when I finish. Uh, they didn't grow in the same size. So this is the one. Ooh, got a package. Let's finish these ones. Okay. They still look cute when they are messy, but let's do something here. They're flying over my house. They're so cute. First I hear a noise and I didn't know what it was going on. Oh, come on. I have one here. Skydiving. Two blueberries. 
this one's supposed to be giving fruits soon and this in July. I'll clean this too. Some of these have to go out mint and what was the other thing? Mint. Oh, Mexican oregano. Okay, we got the blueberries and this one I love some of the uh, mint This one is and the border and then I have the other blueberry there Mint is very strong, doesn't die so easy but I think it looks kind of cute there Okay, time to water everything I'm tired New day. Okay, forgot to remove the plastic of this one so it was not working. We'll charge that one. I got the stream and all this is looking. I need to get a trolley for that one. I sure in this area <sighs> let's see first I will plant my strawberries Ooh, all these are looking good yep a little more neat strawberries 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 have this spot that for some reason look that one didn't went good this went bad this didn't survive this one I need to just cut and we'll be okay and this one is coming good this is coming good and I have these ones so these are add you know all of this I think I will put together in this spot and I think maybe have something else to put let me check Okay, I have one of these that I made from seed. I think it will be good. We will try to put that one in the center.
at the base for my racing bed and the curious dog there he took a shower with while I was watering the plants here and tomatoes are going good they always say that I should take the bottom leaves on the regular tomatoes and not on the cherry because in that way they don't get any disease I didn't know that I'm learning that and then oh my radish this is the last of my radish that I have not removed yet uh, I just took off those are the vine peas that are going slowly and beets I have no clue when they are ready so you will have to read about it this is a cherry tomato and they say that don't don't pull the um, the bottom ones because those begin to give everything so have to help her to go and there is okay need to water now my uh, potatoes the potatoes are growing a lot when they are blooming is when I will be able to harvest them and that is an unknown plant oh, that's good. that I will have to keep I put in a bigger pot until I know what it is so yeah let's water these my next project let's see how I do this <laughs>